hello friend this is my second video about how to write a review article so this is my advice that when you are a PhD student or master student you must need to start writing review article it is very very important you are doing literature review if you are writing review paper or if you are not writing review paper so this is a golden chance a golden time for you to start writing review paper for example uh, if you are uh, working in the field of uh, light emitting diode or photonics whatever so you have to write read about that uh, field particularly for example as i give my first video uh, about how to write review paper in light emitting diode so you are using perovskite material in light emitting diode so you have to read literature about that uh, topic so when you are reading literature so why don't you make compile the, those data and make a review paper for example now we are writing a review paper about uh, progress in perovskite uh, material for lighting uh, emitting diode or you can simply say that perovskite perovskite is a material perovskite material for light emitting diode so you must need to write your your abstract first here but I will give you one thing that uh, abstract people always and always write at the end how for example when you compile your paper when you finish your paper and you just summarize what you got what you wrote and make a short brief paragraph and that is your abstract sometimes people say that uh, let's start now from uh, now the uh, the writing abstract this is very very wrong idea to start writing uh, abstract at the beginning abstract you always write at the end just like a conclusion it is at the first time uh, when somebody read your paper it is at the first place I do agree but you have to write at the end when you are writing your article you have to write at the end so my advice is just write here introduction introduction and just write introduction here and just start compiling your data for example how uh, I am reading this uh, 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 paper for instance and I am reading about uh, uh, perovskite solar seal so let's read the first trihalide perovskite semiconductor are an emerging class of material that have led to great advances in performance of solution processable up to electronic devices very good sentence and this guy also took this sentence this sentence from these four papers you see so if you want to know much about this uh, topic you just go to these four papers these four papers are here from one to four these are from one to four papers here for example references number one ng park here uh, general physical chemistry letter and the second is the uh, nature photons photonics the third one the second one is uh, uh, nature photonic the second one is the general physical chemistry seed the fourth one is in uh, nature new technology so this is how you want to go in detail and if you just want to uh, uh, read this write this sentence in your own words and cite this paper so this is also the way and if you want to know the the exact detail of this sentence that how perovskite is using in this up to electronic devices and solution processable so you just go and just read these four papers okay and he said the, the another part that band gap is tunable through its chemical composition allowing it to be varied across visible and near infrared valence so these are the properties that you can change the band gap and uh, this material can be used in variety of devices they again he, he mentioned every paragraph have a very good uh, knowledge they say recently researchers have explored new application of this material including in light emitting diodes you see oh you are interesting in this lighting with diode and semiconductor optical amplifier you see then here they start here for example uh, if you go to this paragraph here uh, so you will see that uh, there are so many uh, other information good information here this look this 
The large mobilities of in a perovskite suggest promise for light emitting diodes that can be achieved high brightness as low driving voltage. You see, so this is the knowledge about your field. So you can in lasing applications, the low stock shift reduce energy loss to heat during down conversion of the pump. A clean band gap with minimal charge trapping defects increase the efficiency of band gap. You see, this is all about information about the uh, uh, light emitting diode. They again mentioned their perovskite material for light emission. Perovskite possesses the crystal structure of this, where this, this, it's all about. And you must need to go to diagram and see the diagram. So you can also copy this diagram and you can also make by your own. I will uh, show you the method how to make. Uh, there are many softwares you can make. So you just see this, uh, take this data and just uh, write in your own words and just give the citations. This is how you build up the introduction. Here is the introduction. You write the sentences. You write the sentences as that uh, something like that. That perovskite, perovskite, perovskite sh shown uh, tremendous performance in up to electronic devices since its first entry in perovskite solar cell in 2007. Look this is my sentence here and I, I wrote here this very nicely. So you just need to cite here Proskite shown tremendous performance in Apple electronic devices since its first entry in Proskite solar cell in 2023. Uh, it's its first, first entry in the research domain in the uh, research uh, domain in the 16 I mean you see this is how you write your introduction and you just use reference here and using endnote or Mendeley or any other software and you build up your introduction slowly and slowly and gradually do not take this uh, and pressure uh, just enjoy writing this and when you read more, you will write very well. This is what I say many times that a good reader is a good writer. Thanks for watching.